Uh, my name is Cassidy Curtis, and uh, I'm a technical art lead at Google Spotlight Stories. I uh, have been most recently working on Son of Jaguar, directed by Jorge Gutierrez. Um, and uh, my role in these projects is uh, I, I'm kind of the glue that connects the director to the, all of the techni technical people on the team. Uh, so uh, my job is to try to understand what is important to the director uh, in terms of their vision for the visual style of the project and then when they're um, if we're lucky maybe that style is something that uh, that uh, we already have all the technology to do but usually that's not the case and uh, and then we're lucky in a different way because we get to invent something or build something that we didn't have before um, a, a big part of the goal of our project is actually to use these stories as a way to drive the technology that we're developing the, whether it's the tools or the engine and um, so we're trying to, uh, so when we work with a filmmaker, uh, we let them drive that process, you know, and, uh, and so uh, if, if uh, you know, Jorge says he wants the characters to have these bevels and facets and we are not quite sure how to do that, then that's where we get to work and try to figure out how to, how to do that. Um, and uh, so in the, case of, um, in the case of Son of Jaguar, there are some things that we weren't really able to do before that we're doing in this show. We're doing things like shadows and volumetric lighting. You're not seeing any of that in this teaser yet because we're still developing it. I mean, Jorge's work is, is rich, right? And it's got so much detail and so much, uh, you know, there's symbolism everywhere you look, you know? And uh, everything has these layers of meaning behind it. And, uh, um, and you know, it, it's just this kind of uh, abundance of, of stuff. And, and so uh, uh, that, that's a challenge technically, just because that means a lot of data has to get pushed onto the screen every, mo every moment. And, uh, you know, all of these projects, we release them from multiple mediums usually. So, you know, we're showing it here on a Vive, but, uh, you know, it'll also be released for mobile phones and other, other mediums as well. And so um, each of those has different technical uh, limitations on it. Um, and uh, so we have to optimize the show uh, to play well on each of those, in each of those mediums. So that'll be a big challenge for the optimization team is taking all of this richness of information which plays great on the very you know, high-end headgear and make it play just as beautifully on a three-year-old mobile phone. Um, so that'll be a challenge.